are too. This is not a blue state, this is a red state, and we're going to keep it a red state. I know I look funny, I'm a peculiar bird. I'm a country boy, born on a farm, four-room home, no indoor plumbing. I know what it is to appreciate a J.C. Penney's catalog book. <laughs> My parents had very little education. Matter of fact, third grade, both of them, they were sharecroppers. And you know, they taught me good home cooking values. They started out when I was there in the rod. You know what I'm talking about. But they were faith-based. I am a Christian. I believe he died and rose in the third day so I can have everlasting life. And so can you. They taught me hard work and the importance of hard work. The importance of having an education that doors would open up for me that wasn't there for them. They taught me the understanding and appreciation of loving our neighbors, and helping our neighbors, and helping our fellow man and woman. They made sure. They made sure that I respect people because that's the only way you get respect. So I learned this from home. This is nothing new for me. But I also know those conservative values. I am pro-life. Yeah. And the conception does not start at six weeks. It's right. Conception is, matter of fact, life doesn't start at six weeks. Life starts at conception. Let's get that clear. Not six weeks. If you pro life, you can't be pro six weeks pro life. You either pro life or you're not. But let me tell you, I was on a donkey to Damascus. And I got knocked off my donkey. <laughs> Dr. Leah King gave me a book on Planned Parenthood and Margaret Sanger. And that's where I found out that Margaret Singer thought that black people were defective and that they needed to be weeded out like weeds. Mm -hmm. Margaret Singer went across this country trying to abort every black baby she can find yeah. and sterilize every black woman she can find. Mm -hmm. Planned Parenthood is a lie. Yeah. It is a lie. Black Lives Matter when these riots 
hurt over 700 police officers, 26 people killed, including children, yep. black yep. children at that. Yep. How can black lives matter when they want to destroy the nucleus of the black family, mm -hmm. the father and the home? That's right. To promote transgenderism in the black community, as much as we need fathers, period, in homes, mm -hmm. young men need to learn from their fathers. Donald cares about this country. 
Yeah. He wants to put us first. Yeah. Look at where we are now. As a direct result of the leadership of this state, we lost two United States Senate seats yeah. and the president's election. And what do we get from it now? We have Joe Biden, yep. Nancy Pelosi, yep. Chuck Schumer. Yep. They remind me of the Wizard of Oz. <laughs> One has no heart, the other has no courage, and the other has no brain. <laughs>
but agree with what I'm saying, putting Georgia first and put America first. This is going to be a whole new ball game. When we take Georgia, we're going to take this country, y'all. Because can you imagine a black conservative governor from Georgia walk across this country with a whole new message, bringing conservatism back to America, back to our homes, back to our communities. And the hell with that CRT being taught in our school. Yeah.